Yeah? Is rolling? Yeah. Okay. So, Bombay Velvet in Sri Lanka. Sounds a little surprising, right? Uh, well, uh, that's a fact of the matter. Bombay Velvet is our film, which is based in the Bombay of 1950s and 60s. And 85% of the film has been shot in Sri Lanka. Different parts, there's Colombo, there's Gaul, and there is the set at the film city in Rangadhenda. You might ask, how did we land up here? We, well, as a team, we did extensive recce for about six months in different parts of India. Delhi, Bombay, Gujarat, Calcutta, Madhya Pradesh, and collected a lot of information and data. And we are not able to pinpoint where to start and how do we go about shooting this film, how we make the schedule when somebody popped in some pictures of uh, Colombo, some streets and some interior locations. And we said, yeah, it looks good, different possibility, might pull off Bombay of the 1940s and 50s. Let's have a look. We started our association with the film team. And to cut a long story short, I would give the entire credit to the film team for not only influencing us, but being instrumental in bringing the film to Sri Lanka and shooting it here. Well, there are four of them, and if I was to start with Ravi, who is projected as the boss, though all four of them are bosses of to me, uh, a brilliant human being, extremely humble. At no point when you are interacting with Ravi do you realize the power he commands and he holds, because he never gives you that projection. A simple man, but extremely, extremely knowledgeable about everything that happens around him. And a very correct human being, a good human being. Without Ravi's relentless support, I don't think we would have been able to achieve half the things that we've done in Sri Lanka. Next is Error. Well, the more uh, I can keep talking about error all day, but it will still be less. One of the most experienced and knowledgeable human beings I've known in my life. 40 years of experience and still going strong. As a production designer, as an art director, as an executor, unmatched. Absolutely unmatched. I haven't worked with a better art director in my life, to be honest. And there is no ways in hell that I would have been shooting in Sri Lanka if I did not have the option of working with Ed to construct the set of Bombay Velvet. And I haven't had to look behind or sideways anyways during this process because of the confidence he gave us in terms of his execution skills, in terms of is keeping within budget, the team that he manages to put together, and his understanding of cinema and the film. And then there is Kopi. It's been a week that we finished filming here, and trust me, it was one massive shoot. And we've already finished the entire counting with detailed cost reports. How good can it get better than this? A week, that's all. The minute you have that kind of support system with you, filmmaking becomes fun. And you start enjoying the process rather than being stressed about it. That brings us to last but not the least, Ainsley. I don't know where to start about Ainsley. The last three months that I've been shooting here, I can say, apart from shooting, I've been learning every day of the shoot from this man. What a brilliant producer. The only thing I can say about him is that if I had my way, I would have him as my producer on every film that I work from now onwards. With the experience that he has and the calmness with which he approaches, approaches his work, 
I think he would fit into any part of the world as an A-grade producer. His extreme thorough knowledge of every department, he understands the importance of every department. And not once, and I can say that from Vikram, not once was a decision taken by him which was not the best decision. Nobody could have beat him with that. So that brings us to this organization called the Film Team, which is the right name for the company because they are a complete film unit. I haven't seen a better bunch of people making movies. I haven't seen a better bunch of people making movies the way these guys do. And it's not just Sri Lanka. I think I can have them on board in any part of the world. And I know that I should be the best I would ever do. Thank you.